Ladies and gentlemen, family and friends, scholars and dignitaries, welcome to another episode. Welcome to my world. So I love a good cartoon and political memes are the best because they're funny and sometimes reveal a backstory or an underlying theme that either the artist is trying to share or even the media is refusing to tell. And if it's done subtly, you can read into it and see what that artist is trying to say. And if not, well, it's still funny. Now, of course, I don't like memes that are mean-spirited or memes that are blatantly racist or stereotypic, but I have to say that some that border these are still funny, and no, they aren't mean or biased or discriminatory. They are what they are. For instance, everyone knows that Italians invented pizza and that they love pizza. It's a stereotype, yes, but it's also a fact. So here, you take a picture of the world's largest pizza, and it's nicknamed Atavia, made in Rome, Italy, and it covers 13,580 square feet. And then for a good meme, you simply add a simple caption and you make it look realistic, but funny. Hey, do you think it's big enough? We have family coming over for dinner tonight. So is it funny? Absolutely. Is it realistic? Ask any Italian. They would nod yes. And is it a stereotype? Sure but nobody really cares, at least no one that matters to an Italian. So here are 25 political memes floating around the internet. And again, I sincerely apologize if any are insensitive or hurt your feelings. That is not my intention. I just think they're funny. And remember, some of these are ironic, some are iconic, and some, of course, are moronic. I love this one. It's Biden saying, you are a loyal supporter. You'll always have my back, right? And she says, ah, sure. Hey, what's that 25th Amendment thing about again? Well, everyone knows the 25th Amendment is about how to remove a sitting president. AOC saying, we can end world hunger with these donut seeds. a transcript of one of Biden's speeches. This is one of my favorites. Miss me yet? Ah, President Trump, some people are beginning to miss you very, very much. Nancy Pelosi, oh gosh, volunteering for a new Chinese COVID anal swab to eliminate fears of use. We demand equal pay for equal work. Smash the matriarchy. Oh, look at this. Men saying they want to make as much as women. A before and after picture of people going through the Coca-Cola diversity training to be less white. But how do you talk without a brain? I'm with the media. Oh, if this doesn't say it all. No, Joe, go this way. Hey, I've got to tell that no good lying dog face pony soldier. Hey, isn't that racist? I don't even know what that means. Nobody does. Ah, this is a very good one. The China virus, the UK virus, and the American virus. We have to stop demonizing people and realize the biggest terror threat in this country is white men. Oh, Don Lemon, CNN. Stop and read that again really slow. We have to stop demonizing people and realize the biggest terror threat in this country is white men. Oh, thank you, Don. Uh, Yeah, thank you. We have successfully defeated ISIS and Iran's top general. We have officially defeated Mr. Potato Head and Dr. Seuss. Lady Gaga offers $500,000 for two dogs. I guess French dogs matter. If you trust your five-year-old's opinion on what their gender is, but don't trust them with a pair of scissors, you might be a liberal. 
Ah, Jeff Foxworthy nailed that one. Hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil, and just resting. Thank you, Bernie Sanders. Say what if you're guilty? What, what? Oh, we won't even go there. Uh, Governor Andrew Cuomo from New York. Go ahead, punk. Tell me again that Obama was born in the United States. That's Dirty Harry from the early 70s. Wow. And then Schumer whispers to Pelosi, let's try to impeach him a third time. I think this time I can get it through. Wow. And I thought I was evil. This is a good one. Which Democrat was never arrested for sexual harassment? And of course, that's Bill Cosby on the far right. What, me worry? Well, a lot of us are starting to worry right about now. I was there 3,000 years ago when Biden first ran for the presidency, Lord Elrond. One of these people is an idiot. Okay, you got me. <laughs> so there we have it. Several great political memes. And believe me, there's more to come. Enjoy them. Hey, be safe, be well, and God bless.